Well, a group of girls from Royal Palm Beach can call themselves softball state championships, but they didn't get to take home any hardware. Yeah, this is hard to believe. Our Danielle DeRoss has been looking into this. She joins us live in Royal Palm Beach with the award they got instead and why they are so disappointed. Danielle? Yeah, Jim and Luli, the girls you see playing here behind me, they are thrilled to call themselves Babe Ruth State Champions, but they are less than impressed with the prize. While the boys got trophies, the girls got these black drawstring bags. These girls have spirit and skills. And now after months of practice, the Royal Palm Beach eight and under all stars can call themselves state champions after winning the Babe Ruth Diva Division last week. So you're a state champion. How does that feel? Oh, it was great. Um, it felt a little bit too easy. Really? <laughs> but it's the recognition that they got from the tournament that has them crying foul. Instead of trophies or medals, the girls were given a game ball, luggage tags, and these black drawstring bags. I thought it was unfair and I got really disappointed. Players and parents were disappointed, then insulted to find out their counterparts in the boys league got these trophies. Just mad that the boys got it and we didn't. Then when we got it, I was like, okay, well, at least not everyone else didn't get it and we got it. And then I heard the boys got it. Ugh. <laughs> the commissioner of Florida Babe Ruth softball says all girls teams got the same bag and calls the reaction from the Royal Palm team regrettable, adding our intention was to provide the players with the recognition they deserve and a lasting keepsake of this year's tournament. He showed us photos of the plaques and banners given to the winning teams this year, and he claims that they outspent the boys Cal Ripken League when it came to awards. The lady that passed them out was actually apologizing to me for what they were giving us. Coach Amy D'Arch Angelo considers their disappointment over the bags a teachable moment. She wants her athletes, who work just as hard as the boys, to demand the same recognition for the same achievements. It, this isn't about a trophy. It's not about um, softball. This is about teaching these young ladies who I love so much um, to speak up and to do the right thing when they see things that aren't equal. For now, the players are focusing on bigger things. After all, they are playing in the World Series coming up very soon, and that's why they're practicing so hard here tonight. If you want to cheer them on, you have a chance. It's at the end of this month in Jensen Beach. Reporting live in Royal Palm Beach, Danielle DeRoss, CBS 12 News. Wow. Well, maybe they'll have a change of heart. Get them Hopefully. some trophies. Yeah, why not?